How do you do, everybody? I'd like to introduce myself. My name is Ronald Reagan. A few months ago, I was a sports announcer on a radio station in Des Moines, Iowa. One day, I ran into one of these movie talent scouts. I think I caught him off guard because the next thing I knew, I was taking a screen test for Warner Brothers in Hollywood. I guess it was okay. At least I liked Hollywood. So here I am. They did everything they could to make me feel at home, too. The first picture, well, what do you think it was about? A radio station. Would you like to see a few scenes? Stick around a minute. I got to pull with the operator. Hey, give me an entrance, will you? And don't bring politics into your program again. So far as murders are concerned, you can leave them to the police department. But I will sponsor a broadcast devoted to the malicious slandering of our city's leading citizens. That is final. Good night. If Nichols drops out, we're left with a sustaining program on our hands. There isn't a firm in town with nerve enough to sponsor a spot he puts his finger on. My job is spreading news. That guy and his mayor brother-in-law are in with Nicey Ferguson's gang. Mr. Nichols is riding for a fall. And you're the mattress he's going to fall on. Introducing your news commentator, Andy McCain, and his regular broadcast of hot news with the courtesy of E.E. E. Nichols' department store. Hello again, folks. Here's something hot right off the griddle. George Copeland, who promised to start his war against the city's gambling syndicate today, has been missing from his home since yesterday morning. As yet, there hasn't been a single clue as to his whereabouts. Well, I can't call you Uncle anymore. And I can't call you Andy anymore. What shall I call you? scene is June Travis. Nice girl. As I said before, I think I'm going to like Hollywood. She had me in the doghouse for a while in this picture, but uh, I managed to get out of that all right. Then there's Robert Barron, a swell actor, even though we quarreled in the story. Eddie Acuff gets a lot of laughs with his comedy role. Well, that's all I can tell you about the picture, except that when you see it, I hope you like it. If you have a little spare time, why, drop me a line at Warner Brothers Studios in Hollywood. I'll see you in the movies. (laughs) 